growing up No Pirellis Me and my girls, we hopping out in foreign things Prime time, my nigga, my time Tryna get at me, but who ain't nigga late in line? We ain't come here for this Most of these bitches ain't built like this Princess Leia, I am back with another video. Today's video, I'm actually going to be sharing with you guys my favorite fall luxury scents. Oh my god, this video is so much overdue. Before we get into the video, make sure I subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell so y'all get my videos as soon as I drop because I'm dropping like it's hot all October long. Now, if y'all know anything about me, I love to smell good, I love different scents, different smells, and especially fall time. So, we're going to get into these fragrances. I am doing it from my least to best just so that you guys can get an understanding of you know the fragrances and everything like that i'm going to try to do my best to explain all the notes in every fragrance so that you guys can maybe get like a visual or kind of like a i guess a smell understanding of it um it's really hard to talk about smells and you guys actually because you can't smell through the camera so but i'm gonna try to give y'all the best that i can understand so with that being said oh my god i'm so excited the first fragrance that I want to share with you guys, I'm gonna go with Twilly. This is Twilly by Hermes. Now these all are designer luxury scents. I will make sure I list everything in the description below so that you guys can go check it out. I always recommend trying out samples of perfumes first. It's different when you shop for perfumes. You can't just buy a big bottle and expect to just like it. You have to actually try it out, see how it wears on you, see how it you know, fits into your lifestyle. And you know, boom, if you like it, just go buy a bigger bottle. But this is the Twilly by Hermes. And this Twilly, it has a very powder fresh scent. Like if you just want to get out the shower and just spray on a couple, it don't it really don't take a lot. It has a very powdery fresh scent to it. That's that's the best way I can explain it. I love wearing it, especially in the fall. I feel like it just kind of gives like a vibrant, a vibrance to fall. I don't know how to if that makes any sense, but it definitely smells really good. I can smell the luxury in it. I love the packaging on this. It's very colorful. The bow is super duper cute. It's a really cute petite bottle. And I just love the way that they put this together, you guys. So that is Twilly. My next one would have to be... I'm going to go with Dossier. This is the Floral Jasmine by Dossier. Now, Dossier is a luxury perfume brand, and basically what it is, it's a website where you can go and order some of your favorite scents, but in their brand. So, if you think about, like, Gucci or this this one right here is mocked after Tom Ford, and it smells just like it. It wears so, so freaking good. It smells so good, y'all. But if you want, you know, something more on the cheaper side, if you do want a designer scent, make sure y'all check out Dossier because their smell, oh my god, their smells is so, so perfect to the actual real thing. Um, and like I said, if you're on a budget and you just want to smell like the real thing, but you, you know, you, y'all, Dossier is where you need to go. Okay, I'll list this below as well. This is the Floral Jasmine. Like I said, it's a mock of Tom Ford. And it has Neroli, Cardamom, Bergamot, Pepper, which are, which are the top notes. The middle notes are Jasmine, Sambok, Lang Lang, Broom Flower, and the base notes are Labdanum, Clary Sage, and Vanilla. And when I tell y'all this right here, this is definitely like a grown woman scent. I can definitely smell the vanilla with the mix of the bergamot. I feel like it's a very deep type of uh, smell. It, it it smells so good, y'all. I was actually first put on time for it by my friend Trini. She wore it on one of our trips. I think we went to New Orleans and she wore it and y'all, it was amazing. So my next scent would have to be the Gucci Guilty. Y'all, you can never go wrong with Gucci Guilty. If y'all ain't got this in your perfume collection, girl, you guilty as hell. You better go and get you some Gucci Guilty. I feel like every woman should have this in their collection. Um, this is actually the new bottling that they've done. Gucci Guilty was actually in a, like, I feel like the last bottling that they had was kind of like really short and like fat. This one is a little bit more sleek and just cute and just, oh, uh, it reminds me of like a, uh, uh, what they call them kind of bottles. 
uh, a flask. Like when you drink out of the, um, you know what I'm saying? When you drink out of the bottle like that, that's what it reminds me of. But it's super duper cute. Love the bottling. It smells really good. Very much of a grown woman smell. When it comes to like designers like that, that are from like overseas, they have certain type of wordings for their for their fragrances like parfumé or parfumé. I don't know how to say it, but certain things mean certain things. And I guess with this one, this is like the basic one, and they have like a more intense one, and so on and so forth. But this one right here is where you need to start if you really want to get into just starting off your designer collection with perfume. Y'all need to get the Gucci Goose. Period. So next, I am going to go with. Chloe baby Chloe I love 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 my Chloe I just love my Chloe I was put on to Chloe she's so cute I love Chloe she just always just give me very much classy rich girl like Chloe I, I was put on to Chloe by a, a couple of my friends we went on a trip to Vegas and like all my friends were wearing it and they just smelled like a bunch of rich ass bitches so I was like oh I want to get me some smell like my friends Woo, baby Chloe it just reminds me it's so nostalgic like it just oh you can never go wrong with Chloe I don't care what nobody say y'all gotta get y'all some Chloe super duper cute Flo actually got me this as a gift um I started out I think when I first got it I started out with like a really small travel size but Flo got me this as a gift and y'all this is the perfect gift to get for somebody you know birthday mother mother-in-law whatever y'all want to try um perfect y'all and it smells so good my next one is another Chloe. This actually came out, I think, um, I think this came out this year, actually. This is a new Chloe. It's the Chloe Nomad, and I always love how cute Chloe bottles be, y'all. This right here, though, I would have to say this right here is by far my favorite. I've been wearing this recently. This was like my summer scent, but it's taking me into like fall. If you look at the bottle, it has like a fall type of color to it, like the colors of it, like the little bow on it. It's just like a fall vibe. I feel like this right here is definitely like, I love Chloe. I can't even, I don't know what to say. I just feel like everything that I've tried with Chloe has been just great. And it's just so, my baby, this is my baby, y'all. This is my baby. And as y'all can see, it's a little bit goes a long way. I don't, I usually don't spray too much of my perfume. It don't really take a lot unless you're trying to smell like a, a old church lady. I feel like you don't need to ever spray a lot of designer perfumes because they wear on so strong. Like y'all don't need a lot. Last but not freaking least, y'all. Now, this right here is going to take y'all up. I'm sorry. It's going to send y'all all the way up to the heavens and the earth. So, this right here is my Maison Kirk de John, y'all. This is that Baccarat Rouge by 40. Oh, shit. And when I tell you that this right here is some boss lady shit. This is probably the most expensive perfume that I have in my collection, y'all. And it is so, so, so 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 worth it y'all when i spray this on and i walk in the room baby i'm turning heads i'm shaking tables i'm baby when i this right here is like boss boss i think this is even men can wear this i don't even have the words to say but when i walk in the room everybody be asking what is you wearing who is that who is smelling like that y'all the baccarat rouge baby number one Okay, when I tell you shake a room, shake a motherfucking room. Like, you can never go wrong with this, y'all. If y'all have it in y'all budget to spend it, baby, get it. You know, I'd be so embarrassed to tell people that I've even spent this much money on perfume. But honestly, like, I'm so big on, like, smelling good. Because I feel like when you smell like something, it... It, it does something it means a lot for your character like you care about the way you present yourself to people and the way that you just carry yourself you care about you know personal hygiene and things like that and so this right here like this is another gift that i got for my birthday as well but i had already been on it you know what i'm saying um i actually have the body oil and the spray so this right here y'all when you put the two together the body oil and the spray Leia who? Princess who? Baby, when I princess, okay, princess all day. Real, this is some real king, queen, boss, princess, prince, royal shit. This smells so freaking good. One thing that I would have to say is y'all would just have to go inside of like a Nordstrom or a Bloomingdale's and just try it on. Ask for the Baccarat Rouge 540. I've had people even come up to me and ask me, you wearing the Baccarat Rouge? Yup. And do. And it is. <laughs> and you ain't. <laughs> 
<laughs> girl a bitch can't touch me when it comes to this okay like don't play with me but yes this is definitely like a rich girl fragrance you guys if you are interested i'm gonna list this below everything going in the description make sure y'all check this out like i said sample it sample all this stuff one thing about perfume like i said in the beginning is perfume you can't shop for perfume like you shop for clothes i could literally be in a fragrance store for hours trying to find different fragrances that i like depending on my mood depending on the type of year all of these scents are perfect for fall you guys i feel like summer scents are more so like your citrus citrusy scents like your flower bomb your um, I'm trying to think of another scent that's more like citrusy. There's also a Gucci Bloom. Gucci has a line, Gucci Bloom. They also came out with a summer collection. Um, but like I said, the Gucci Guilty is one that can just, it's an all year round wear. But I feel like it's its its a really deep smell, so it can go for like fall, you know. Um, but anything that's like summer, it's more like citrusy, very fruity smells. So y'all don't see any of that in this collection. Um, but when the summertime comes, I'll be definitely updating y'all on that as well, because I definitely can pull out a lot of perfumes for that as well but one thing about me i am a big girl and i like big shit i like things that smell good I, I like things that look good i like things that taste good i'm just really big on big stuff i'm so happy that i could actually share that with y'all because i just feel like my daughters they was like why would people? they were asking me what kind of video i was doing i was like i'm doing a video on all my all my fragrances that that i wear and like my fall stuff and so they were like why would people want to watch that I'm like, well, because there's people out there who really like, you know, perfumes and stuff like that and fragrances and smelling good. See, they're young. They're young girls. I'm schooling them while they're young, but they won't understand until they hit about maybe 12 or so like that. Right now, they just want to run outside and come back inside and smell like sweat. They don't care. I thank you guys so much for watching this video. Oh, my God. This meant so much to me. I was so, so happy to do this video for y'all. Super duper fun because it's a part of me that I just... I love, you know, so just y'all get to know more about me, what I like. This is a reflection of me, a piece of me. Y'all get to see what I wear, um, this type of stuff I like. You know what I'm saying? A little bog, a bog. But anyways, so I appreciate y'all again for watching the video, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Pretty girl, pretty girl game. Pretty girl, pretty girl game. If you wanna bad and don't get a bag, then you cannot sit with us. Let me hear you say. Pretty girl, pretty girl Pretty girl, pretty girl and don't grab a glass, but you cannot sip with us. Let me hear you say, Pretty girl, pretty girl gang. Pretty girl, pretty girl gang. All of my bad bitches. Pretty girls, pretty girls. Let me hear you say, Pretty girl, pretty girl gang. Pretty girl, pretty girl gang. Cause most of these girls is average. And me and my girls, we the baddest. Pretty girl gang. Gang, gang, gang. All of my girls, they pretty.